This video demonstrates the monthly periodic procedures required to maintain a sliding door and is part of a series of walk-in cooler door maintenance videos. For this adjustment, you will use a lube gun with food grade machinery grease, food grade silicon spray, a small rag used to avoid chain over spray, a 7 16 inch wrench, and a dollar bill. First, operate the door to reach the closed position and turn off the power to the door controller. Now the door is safe to work on. Let's start with the track rollers. Grease the axles as needed with food grade machinery grease. While in the same location, grease the idler sprocket as needed with the food grade machinery grease. Next, move to the drive chain. Lightly oil the drive chain as needed with food grade silicon spray. Also, check for proper tension at this time. The chain should not sag or move up and down more than one half inch. If adjustment is needed, use our video how to adjust a sliding door drive chain. In the same location, use the food grade silicon spray to lightly lubricate the pivot on the release latch and the internal tube for the cable in the cable bracket. Take this time to inspect the cable for looseness and, if required, tighten the cable using the 7 16 inch wrench. Next, inspect the sliding door gasket for proper 1 8 inch compression and light tight seal using a dollar bill. If the dollar bill slides between the door and the gasket, then follow the instructions to tighten the seal in our video, How to Adjust a Sliding Door Gasket. At the bottom of the door, lightly spray the oil impregnated bushings of the stay rollers with food grade silicon spray. Do this monthly for maximum life and efficiency. While still at the bottom of the door, inspect the bottom neoprene sweep gasket for proper light tight seal. Adjust or replace as needed. Our video, How to Adjust Sliding Door Height, covers this process. Now turn the power back on at the controller and test cycle the door through its complete operation. More technical videos are available from the Imperial Brown website or directly on the Imperial Brown YouTube channel. Leave us a comment on YouTube, Facebook, or Twitter and let us know how your maintenance went or to suggest another video.